Quest Pro controllers continue to experience significant firmware update and connection problems. These issues persist despite various software updates from Meta. In early 2025, update V72 caused a major disaster, bricking numerous headsets and completely disrupting Pro controller functionality. Some users reported controllers wouldn't link up at all. By June 2025, some users reported improvements with Quest Pro controllers and Quest 3 compatibility, but there's no guarantee these issues won't return with future updates. Users commonly report several specific symptoms. Controllers lose their orientation tracking, fail to reconnect after periods of inactivity, encounter errors during firmware updates, and sometimes experience complete connection failures. The first and most important troubleshooting step is ensuring your controllers are properly charged. Use the included charging dock to fully charge both controllers before attempting any other fixes. When controllers experience update failures, they display specific flashing light patterns. Purple indicates an update in progress, red means the update failed, blue shows pairing mode, and white typically indicates low battery. Understanding these controller issues and their indicators is the first step toward effective troubleshooting. In the next section, we'll cover specific troubleshooting steps and best practices. The first troubleshooting step is to reset your Quest Pro controllers. This clears any connection issues and prepares them for repairing. After resetting, you need to repair the controllers using the MetaQuest mobile app. Navigate to the Devices section and select controllers to begin the pairing process. Environmental factors can affect controller tracking. Ensure your play area has balanced lighting without extreme bright or dark spots, and restart your headset to refresh the connection. Keeping firmware updated is crucial. If updates fail to download, try using a mobile hotspot to force the update, as this can bypass network issues that prevent proper firmware installation. If all else fails, perform a factory reset on the controllers. Navigate to Settings, then Devices, then Controllers, and select Factory Reset. This will erase controller data, but preserve your purchased apps and games. According to experts, controller issues often stem from faulty tracking cameras or liquid damage. These controllers use the same joystick modules as Quest 2 and 3, making them susceptible to joystick drift over time. Following these troubleshooting steps systematically will resolve most Quest Pro controller issues. Start with the simple reset and pairing process, then move to environmental factors and firmware updates before considering a factory reset.